Now we're gonna do back mount control. One of the basic positions often misunderstood. Let's practice it. So in the back mount, I want to be on his back like a backpack or like a very annoying parasite. And to me, it's really important to stay small. If you've ever had like a small brown or black belt on your back, it's absolutely horrible because there's nothing to grab. So I try to look, basics is my legs are here. As soon as I cross my feet, he could cross his feet over mine, cross your feet over mine. Yeah, and I break my feet. So I keep them parallel. And I try not to enter my, toe, my toes into his knee pit for the same reason. Now I bring my ankle joint into danger. So I clamp down my heels into his hip, like so. And I keep them fairly close to his hip joint because now it's impossible for him to move his leg around my feet. When my hooks are here, even if I try to enter deep, he can straighten his left leg, not straighten it, straighten, 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 that means pushing forward, no, that's backwards. <laughs> Do you know what straight means? Gerade. Yeah, see now my leg can slip off, oh. But if I'm here, even if he's straightening his leg, Nothing happens to my foot control. Now, I always try to have pack control, this one. So I'm kind of opening him up like a barbecue chicken, <laughs> like so. I know many people very much like the seat belt grip and I despise it. Because the seat belt means that he can control my arm. Yeah, and I don't want to give him that. So the whole, yeah, can you please let go because I, I will not be able to pull it back. Can you please let go? Can you? <laughs> you don't know what letting go means either. <laughs> You're a nasty little man. Okay, <laughs> letting go means loslassen. Okay, so I try to not show him anything. Nor do I want to have him here because he could headbutt me. He probably will, I'm being careful here. So I'm keeping my forehead on the base of his skull, which means I got more control now. See, so I'm here, bap, and I'm pulling back his gi, his collar, into his shoulder plate, into his shoulder, to open him. So like this, I got the best back mount control I could ever dream of. I can pull him left and right, and even when I let go of one hand, I got this <coughs> hand here, and now I tighten the control of this arm. And when I want to go for any attack, I just sneak it in. I do never expose my arm forward or he will grab it. So I'm just sneaking it in to go for maybe bone arrow choke. So that's the basics of back mount control. How to stay on somebody's back and be really annoying. Okay.